three reasons to share love this Feel Good Friday. Today I share three stories that shine a light on affairs of the heart in the lead up to Valentine's Day on Sunday. One thing star-crossed lovers in the area don't have to worry about this Valentine's Day is bagging a reservation at a candlelit restaurant. In normal times, even the most mediocre eatery is booked solid on 14th of February. But alas, thanks to lockdown, that won't be the case this year. So how can couples celebrate the Feast of St. Valentine in style? Diana Wiley, a marriage therapist and board certified sex therapist, urges those in relationships to be creative. She told the NBC that couples should focus on creating their own bubble of love. Ways to do this include dressing smartly, no onesies or tracksuits, buying your loved ones a thoughtful gift, lingerie or some luxury bath items, and don't obsess over the fact that you can't go out. Make 2020 the year you create a Valentine's tradition that doesn't involve overpriced set menus. The survey says, well, frugal types will, look, will be delighted to learn that you don't have to spend big on your partner this Sunday. That's according to relationship coach Luanne Ward, who surveyed couples about their Valentine's Day's likes and dislikes. Ward, an Australian who runs a matchmaking agency, says 63% of men and women surveyed think heartfelt gestures are more important than expensive gifts. So, if you were planning to present your other half with a pricey piece of jewellery or an expensive bottle of booze, think again. A home-cooked meal and a card might suffice. And if you're going to show your love with flowers, they don't have to be red roses, which are usually eye-wateringly expensive on the 14th of Feb. The survey found that 80% of women would prefer to receive their favourite flower instead of red roses. The question is, do you know your beloved's favourite bloom? When it comes to everlasting love, birds are much more likely than mammals to stick with the same partner for life. Only about 5% of mammal species, excluding humans, are monogamous compared to 90% of bird species, figures from the WWF. You won't be surprised to learn that lovebirds mate for life. Other loyal species include bald eagles, barn owls, pigeons, vultures, scarlet macaws, flamingos and mute swans. Side night, if a male mute swan dies, his female work will find a new partner within weeks. However, if a female mute swan dies, the male waits until the following autumn or winter before budding up with another swan. From all of us here at Love M44, thanks for watching and have a great weekend. Stay safe.